So now we're here live with you, coming from Martins in Long Beach. Mm -hmm. And I'm doing a little blessing with the Copal incense, that's C-O-P-A-L, and it is a resin, if you don't know, it's a white resin, it comes from Mexico, and um, here's a little incense burner I made out of clay, a little jaguar, and you do the blessing of north, south, west, and east. In other words, you see that cross, so oftentimes when you see us do it in the Aztec dance ceremonies, we do like this over the drums. Mm. See, we do that cross over the drums, over, over, the, over the people that are dancing. That's and good. it's always customary for us to go like this and, and waft it towards you, but mm. do not inhale it because it is mm. resin. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> but when you go to the Aztec death ceremonies, <laughs> it's all over the place. And so you can't even see people at the, at the ceremonies. And what's so it called go. again? It's called Copal or Copali in Nahuatl language. Copali. And so that's what we do. We ask that the Creator let us uh, clear the space of any kind of uh, energy that we don't want, things that we don't know, things that we might sense earlier or, think, or not at all, or just to be sure. It's kind of like just saying, good luck, a spiritual good luck. Ooh. And so I'm going to hand over to Ms. LJ. Ah, well, do you want to play a little music to start us off? Yes, I'm going to start with an uplifting mood, okay? Mm. And then we're going to go into the inner realms. for a minute. Yes, welcome here with me, Laura Jane, and <clears throat> my friend Martin Espino, coming to you from Long Beach in Martin's upstairs studio here, <laughs> where he's sharing just some of what he does with native music and performance and composing, and some of the instruments he plays, and a lot of them he's made. So thank you so much, Martin, already. And so we are calling this our Alchemy Fridays offering for really the world right now just realizing that things are intense and tender and challenging and changing and I really get the sense we really get the sense that we're all feeling it so much and this year has been a, a hard one and continues to be intense right so 
we're just wanting to offer this to you to soak it up, to let yourself settle in in a comfortable position at whatever time you catch this. We'll also be uploading it later to different platforms. But just a chance for you to refresh and replenish and take care of you in some of these powerful medicinal ways. Oh, I see so many of our loved ones here. Good to see you, Sheena and Rick and Stephanie and Jovian. <laughs> so we're here and we decided for these Alchemy Fridays that we wanted to have a weekly theme. And so this week's theme is feeling it to free it. And this comes from my awareness and Martin's a big meditation teacher himself actually and has been practicing since he was a young child. But that part of what we get from things like meditation is a chance to tune into how we're doing, how we're feeling, and to let ourselves even feel it, right, as an opportunity to potentially free it. So that is sort of what we're going to get to do here in our time together and as we close our eyes and get still and breathe and relax and let Martine's music move through us as the energy medicine that it is, that we can know this can be alchemy for us, right, to let ourselves feel how we are actually feeling, notice how we are dealing, right, with that self-compassion and kindness and non-judgment we were talking about last week. medicine for us right really that approach with ourselves that we're going to have while we're here and letting ourselves feel the feelings to free the feelings so using the stillness the breath the awareness the observer perspective and most of all that kindness compassion joining with that awareness right and then yeah the power of the medicine of the energy of what Martine's offering us with all these amazing native sounds that are moving through us, freeing up stuck energy, even feelings shifted by the music, right? Because it's all such powerful vibrations. So inviting you to allow that, get comfortable, settle in. If you are ready to do this now, or you can actually do it later if you're just catching it right now. So settle in, let's get ready for some feeling it in order to free it and that is what I like to teach about meditation it's not just to quiet our minds even though a lot of us will quiet our minds and that is part of what's going to be healing and shifting about it right but that we're also going to be noticing what's true and watching our minds and that's just as important in meditation and because when we start to let ourselves feel it, we get a chance to more like free it and recognizing it as energy and even stored trauma. So amazing that you're here and I'm so thankful to share this with you from my practices and perspectives in psychology. Martin bringing his expertise and wisdom. And my aim is going to be to talk us into a little meditation here, weaving in a little bit of breath, to talk as little as possible also so that we can soak up Martine's amazing sounds and even the silence underneath the sounds. So we're so glad you're here. And get comfortable sitting, laying down, eyes open, eyes closed, your choice. Most important that you're comfortable, in my opinion. And able to relax. A little bit more aligned position for the spine can be helpful whether you're sitting or laying down, feeling more symmetrical. But you certainly don't have to be cross-legged or uncomfortable. In fact, that really doesn't help meditation, in my opinion, to be uncomfortable. So choose your position, settle in, move a little if you need to, to be able to start to get still. your eyes if you want as that brings that attention even more inward right needs that focus and then let's just start to add some of the ways we can relax ourselves that can really work like softening the face relaxing the jaw as a tool to just shift 
shift the nervous system, help the rest of you relax every time you do that. And then just start to experiment with how much you can soften, relax, let go of tension, tightness. Again, feel free to move a little bit if you need to, to help that. And then see what you can do to settle in and just practice relaxing like it could be like softening. Maybe even becoming aware of your body on the ground or the chair, getting into that presence, that mindfulness, starting to feel into sensations more. And start to bring in more of a listening mind, as in more of a meditative mind. If you haven't already, start to notice your breath. That's such a great part of the therapy here and just starting to be with your breath more before we start to change anything. Just keep relaxing, keep settling in. We're letting those senses help us shift gears. And we're starting to do that in our listening as well, right? Starting to notice. Especially when you breathe into your belly and really fill it up more like a soft balloon. And then slow or longer exhales out of your mouth or nose are going to be what's actually relaxing, helping you free stuff up, let stuff go. So just start to experiment with that. Play with that. present and into the moment. Keep breathing, keep relaxing. You can have your hands in your lap, maybe palms down, maybe palms up. Maybe you'd like to add a mudra. I'll offer the relaxation mudra, middle finger to thumb if you'd like an idea. Just breathing more slowly and fully, practicing that relaxing, getting into your listening mode, your feeling mode. Noticing how all these elements are giving us something to focus on with the mind and bring us into the moment. You can start to quiet that mind for seconds at a time. Keep breathing, keep relaxing. Let your mind be filled up with those sounds. Let your body start to receive the vibration of the sounds. Keep breathing, keep relaxing. Remember to love yourself through that. And then as you want, bring in your attention back more into the presence, the listening, the feeling, the sounds, the quiet. So this is all some of what I see meditation can be, and I'm gonna get quiet there soon so we can just listen breathe and do some of these things while Martine plays music. I'd just like you to have an idea of what you can be doing on the inside to make this more like meditation. And a time and moment of meditation, right? That relaxing, that breath, that listening, that feeling, that presence. And then, just to add the spiritual aspects, if you like that, remember that as we're listening, as we're tuning in, we get to be even more tuned into that aspect within ourselves and in life around us, right? Whether we feel like it's our intuition, higher self, inner knowing, our heart, our 
our soul, right, or universe, God. So listening for that, too, as part of that listening. So listening to you, listening to that more divine aspect of you, and letting that silence fill you up in between. There's so much of how this is going to shift us. And as we move forward for the next bit of time listening to Martine more, just keep using your breath. Keep using your relaxing. Keep noticing if thoughts and feelings come up, knowing you're feeling it to free it, right? And even letting the sound free that up, the breath, the relaxing. Just notice how you're feeling at this point. Bring yourself back into your body and your senses if you found yourself getting into thought or reflection or contemplation. And again, knowing that doesn't mean anything went wrong and that's part of the therapy. To be doing that listening within and loving yourself through that as part of how we can feel it, to free it. And then keep using that breath, keep using that relaxing as such power tools for you to help you shift and allow that alchemy of this combination of sound and breath and meditation.
or tightness or feelings coming up that you're moving through.
come at this point, and we could say towards the end of our meditation time together, just let yourself do a little bit more noticing of how you're doing, maybe what this has been like for you, what you've witnessed, observed, realized even. Breathe into that. Exhale, let go of even more of what you might be ready to let go of. Feel how you feel some shifting, some tuning of yourself mentally, physically, emotionally, and most of all, energetically. Keep breathing into and relaxing into those changes. Give yourself more present, more listening, more here and now. More in the body, more in the moment. More reconnected with you, what's true for you. awareness, that spiritual listening you might like to be in, and ready to carry all of this into the rest of the day.
things that we all do feel each other so much. And that right now as you take care of how you feel, you are making a difference on those around you. You are lifting the energy of the planet. It is important work you can do. So silently thank yourself for taking this time to take care of you, to tune you with us. Notice what's different and better. Feel yourself just embodying that more back into how you might like to feel and focus. And then when you feel ready, you can start to kind of wake yourself up, maybe stretch and move if you like. Integrate your work you've done here, that sound work, how it's shifted you. Give yourself one more slow, deep breath to integrate what you've allowed here. See that in you and all other beings on the planet at this time. And just bowing to that, remembering that, and being ready to go out into the world with that. Right. I'm so thankful. 